Now I will show you how to use so-called complementary numbers for 5. 1 and 4 together are 5. 3 and 2 also gives 5. This we can use to make calculations faster than by the exchange method. If I have 3 and want to add 2, I can do like this. Add 5. This is how much you added. But you, you uh, wanted to add 2, so you have added 3 too much. I take that away. The answer is 5. Now we do the same with 1 plus 4. Put in 1, you want to add 4, but instead you add 5. Now you have added 1 too many, take it away. This gives 5. This is 3 plus 2. When you hear plus 2, you should react by thinking, think a 5 bead and take away the complementary number. So if you hear plus, think minus. If you hear minus, you think plus. So, for example, 4 plus 1. Put in a 5 bead and think complementary, minus 4. 5 minus 3. Take away a 5 bead and think complementary, plus 2. 3 plus 2. Put in a 5 bead and think complementary, minus 3. Result is 5. 5 minus 2. Take away a 5 bead and think complementary, plus 3. Result is 3.